guys and welcome back to my channel. Today's video, as you've probably seen by the title of it, is a Primark haul. These are my absolute favourite videos to watch and film and my favourite shop to go in and I just love everything about Primark. So as you watch this video on Wednesday, we will have gone to Cornwall on Monday. So I thought I would go and pick up a few bits before we went away. The weather is forecast to be really, really nice and I'm kind of lacking a few summer bits. I did actually go for like three things in particular from watching people's Primark calls and annoyingly they didn't have two of them and one of them they didn't have in my size so that's super annoying but I did get some really, really nice bits. So without further ado, I shall crack on with the video. So before I start showing you what I've got, basically let me just explain my size. So on the bottom I am true to size like a 14 or a 16 on my top true to size I'm probably like a 16 but I always size up in my clothes because in well in my tops obviously not my bottoms because I prefer them to be looser so I feel more comfortable in them so most of the tops other than like one I think are a size 20 purely because I like them big that's just how I roll but true to size I probably am more of a, like a 16 but the first top I picked up was this white t-shirt it says bonjour madame in like a like a velvety felty blue material i thought it was really nice would go with anything with jeans or like you could denim shorts anything you could just style it up as i say this is in a size 20 and this was five pounds the second thing i picked up i got in two different colors I got it in this really nice like yellowy color and then this pale blue color it's again just like a really basic kind of like blue t-shirt quite thin again so I would have to wear a vest up underneath it just so that you can't see my bra but then at the bottom it's got like this little tie detail which I thought was super cute this is really in at the moment and what I like about this top is that it's it's still quite long because with most of like this detail on tops I find that they tend to be like crop and obviously being like a larger girl I hate my stomach so crop is way out of the question for me but I thought this was really nice it looks super comfortable again you could wear it with anything and like I say, I also picked it up in this super nice yellow colour. And both in size 20 and they were £4 each. The next thing I picked up, I saw these literally out the corner of my eye. And I'm so glad that I did because I tried them on when I was there. And then I've tried them on to do the try on this morning. And they are so, so comfortable. They are these long, wide leg trousers. I'm not really sure what material they're made out of. Maybe, I think it's more like a cotton than a jersey, but they are really, really soft. In a, like a darker cornflowery blue colour. They've got a drawstring around the waist and then a elasticated back. So of course that's gonna be really, really comfortable. It's like not digging into anything. But I'm so glad that I just like happened to bump into these because they were an absolute bargain as well. They were only, let me find the tag. Eight pounds, like eight pounds, that's amazing. Like, but with this color, it will go with everything. I'm not sure how well I'm showing them on there, but I have done a try on so you can see what they look like on. But yeah, I picked those up in a size 14. I cannot wait to wear them. The next thing I picked up was just this like basic black t-shirt to go with another item that I bought, but a black t-shirt goes with everything, doesn't it? I got this in a size 16 and it was only three pounds and it's kind of stepped at the back, if you can see that. It's really hard to show a black t-shirt so like there's the front and as you can see the back is a little bit step which i really like this fits perfectly so this has obviously come up really really big so bear that in mind if you do go and decide to get one of these they had them in so many colors like all the colors of the rainbow they had them in but i was specifically after a black one only in a 16 in that one and it fits perfectly so definitely bear that in mind i think they are a little bit bigger than than some others which is funny because this one's a 16 and this is like the perfect fit but the white one with like the blue writing on that's a 20 and i'd say that that really was more of a 16 that's more kind of like snug fitting so then everybody knows what primark size is like it's like a bit on and off sometimes but yeah i thought really basic go with anything this is what i bought the black t-shirt to go with it is a full length maxi skirt it's just a straight skirt there's no slits or anything like that in it come white with a nice stripe it's so flattering so comfortable i don't know if you can see at the top it's 
elasticated as well so really comfy I don't know about you but if you're a bigger girl in these summer months you need all the comfort that you can get there's actually nothing worse than being stuck in restrictive clothes when it's hot and minging outside I love this as well because it is a darker colour so you can wear your chub rub shorts underneath and not be able to see them and I just thought that and that black t-shirt would be a really nice easy casual outfit to chuck on a size 16 and that was only six pounds the only reason I got it in a 16 rather than a 14 is because I didn't want it to be that too restrictive on my bum. I mean, I've not got a massive bum, but like I say, in the summer, being a bigger girl, all I want is comfort. So yeah, I picked that up in a 16. The next thing I got, I really don't know how I'm gonna show you. So again, look out for the try on. It's beautiful. Oh my God, it's so beautiful, so flattering obsessed with the colour this gorgeous gorgeous cor corally colour and it's just a maxi dress as you can see loose bit over the top which I am obsessed with it's just if you don't like your stomach like this is everything this bit it's just like that a bit I've added protection it's got the thicker straps on the arms so that you can still wear a bra with it because I hate wearing strapless bras that's why in none of my hauls ever will you see a off the shoulder top because I just can't get on with them and this super cute like cross detail there is the same at the back and it's just floor length. I got this in a 20. Now really, I think I should have got this in an 18 because it's maybe a little bit big over the bust, but never mind. This was only eight pounds, like eight pound for a maxi dress and I'm obsessed with the color. I really wanted it in some other colors, but they only had gray and I wasn't really massively up for the grey, so I picked up the coral, but yeah, I can't wait to wear that. The next thing that I picked up was this cardigan. Now, I'm not really a cardigan kind of girl, but I really don't like the tops of my arms. I'm trying to get better with it. I'm trying to have a little bit more body confidence. And I thought while we're away, if it gets a bit chilly at night, because obviously we're by the sea, this would just be perfect to chuck on. It's grey with like little blue birds on it. It's like a shorter cardigan with obviously normal length sleeves, a round neck and then button down the front. This in a size 20 as well and that was £8. It also says on it that it's 100% cotton and it feels really, really nice. So yeah, looking forward to wearing that. The next few things I picked up are my Primark staples. I never go to Primark without picking up a couple of pair of leggings. So I just got a black pair and a navy blue pair, both in size 16. They were both £2.50. Again, I could have got these in a 14. They would have definitely fitted but... I'm all about the comfort. These are capri length, so they'll come to like halfway down my calf. But yeah, perfect for summer. That means I can chuck away all the others that I've got now. I just love to replenish them because you know how leggings can go quite see-through. So yeah, I just thought I'd pick them up. The next things that I picked up are two pairs of flip-flops. I was desperate for flip-flops. It's one of the reasons why I needed to go to Primark. I just decided to get them in the navy blue because, again, that goes with everything. And I also got them in the gold because I thought that they looked really, really nice with either the blue pants or the coral dress. I thought that would look really nice. They were 90p each. I was actually having this discussion with Paul the other day how I'd love a pair of Havianas, but when they cost, like, £30 and you can get more or less identical other than they don't have Haviana on the strap in Primark for 90p I just personally can't justify it so I live in dying these in the summer I wear them instead of like slippers because it's too hot they're perfect just for like flip flapping out with the kids love them so so comfortable as well I've never ever had them like rub me in between my toes I love them the next little thing that I picked up were these shorts. Now these are definitely short shorts. I probably wouldn't wear these out of the house. The reason I picked these up is that if it's like a really hot day and we're having a barbecue and we're not leaving the house, we're not doing anything, I just thought they'd be really comfy for like slobbing in the garden in. Just chuck them on with a t-shirt if I'm not going anywhere and sit in the garden on my sun lounger. That is how I'm living this summer. They were, four, they're a size 14 and they were, £2.50, like £2.50. They had them in all different colours as well. The next thing that I picked up, I actually had to put on yesterday when I was in Primark because my, the shoes that I went in were absolutely killing me, are these. Now, I know people are either going to love them or they're going to hate them, but I love them. I had a pair of these before, but they weren't this super fluffy 
pink oh my god just look at them I've been after a really really fluffy pair for ages and ages and ages and yesterday i stumbled across these in primark they were reduced from eight pound to four pounds so i thought you're going right in my basket and as soon as they came out of primark they went right on my feet they're very very comfy the only thing i'd say is i'm normally a seven and i had to size up to an eight in these because this bit is quite tight i'm wondering if like when i've worn them in a little bit that it will like loosen off but yeah i don't even care i'll suffer through the pain because i just absolutely love them they had them in gray as well but they didn't have my size it's amazing paul hates them and that makes me love them even more the next thing that i picked up i've seen in so so many people's primark hauls are the fake chanel espadrilles i love espadrilles anyway if you saw my asos haul a couple of weeks ago i picked up two pairs from there these are definitely like my go-to shoes in the summer and i just thought i'd have these i got a pair of these from primark last year which didn't have like the platform sole but i accidentally picked up an eight and they're way too big i can't wear them so i picked up the seven this time I like them, they're comfy, I just don't know what I think of this. I don't know if I think it's a bit too platformy, I'm not sure. They were only £6. I do like them, I'm just not 100% sure on this. So I might try, it on, try them on with an outfit and see what I think. And then if I'm not a fan, I might take them back. But. The next couple of bits that I picked up um, aren't really like clothing items. They're more like the miscellaneous items that you tend to get from Primark. The first thing I picked up were these five pairs of sport footy socks. I like live and die in these socks. These are the kind of socks I wear with these because I don't not like wearing socks. So you can't see them, they're totally invisible and these are so, so soft. They feel amazing. They were £3.50. They do do cheaper ones like foot liners, but I went for these because they're really, really soft and I think sometimes the other ones irritate my feet a little bit because they're like quite cheap and not not nice so yeah i picked those up the next thing that i picked up was this shower cap now i only wash my hair every other day and when i have a shower on the night that i don't wash my hair i use shower cap i've been using these from primark for years and years and years and i just pick a new one up whenever i go it's just one of them things again like these i pick these up every time i go having two little girls bobbles tend to go missing everywhere so these are like the kind of things that i just pick up every time that i visit because i can never have enough the next thing i picked up are two pairs of false nails i actually have these ones on at the moment and i love them i've raved about primark nails before i discovered them in my last primark haul and i've got to say i just i think they're fantastic they're so cheap these were a pound each and they last me for a good like four days and i could restick them on then if i really wanted to this time i did want to go for something a bit shorter so they're a bit more manageable so yeah i've got this color these are called nude and they're like an almond shape and i got this color which is called cloud and they are a pointed shape they look a little bit longer but i can definitely i can work with it it's fine pound each so i picked up those the next thing i picked up was this super cool hairband now i don't know if i can pull this off sometimes i forget that i am a mother of two and not like an 18 year old cool stylish girl but I figured for days when my hair's up, maybe when it's a bit greasy, this is a good way to jazz it up. Again, I got it in blue because I thought it was a neutral colour that will go with everything. This was £2.50 and it does show you there all the different ways you can use it. So it's like round your head, so round your neck in like a bow, then round your neck is like a scarf or attaching it to your handbag. So whether I'll have any success in actually being able to use it and tie it myself is a different story, but I definitely thought I'd give it a go. The next thing I picked up was this Primark False Lash Effect Mascara. I didn't actually check the colours. Oh, it is black. Thank God for that. Uh, this was £2.50. I am blessed to have very good eyelashes. So I never, ever spend a lot of money on mascara because I just, I feel like I don't need to. The, the one I'm using at the moment is actually a natural collection one from Boots and I saw this one and I just thought I'd pick that up because I like Primark Mascara and I needed a new one. The next things I picked up are some jewellery items. I picked up this five pack of anklets. Now I love anklets, I know some people hate them. But I, I love them, I love to wear them all summer. The only problem is a lot of the time I find that they've come off and I've lost them. So I thought with a five pack I couldn't really go wrong. So I picked them up for £3 and I also picked up this 
10 pack of you know like the midi finger rings for £1.50 they are in the size large and in like I'm not sure if it's rose gold or gold I'm not sure but I thought they'd be quite cute the last couple of things I picked up are super boring but I needed to go and get them I got two pairs of trainer socks for the kids because let's face it kids can never have too many pairs of socks they were £1.80 for seven pairs of these ones and £2 for five pairs in these ones all just different colours and last but not least I picked up a pair of flip flops for hubby he needed some new ones so I just got him these navy men's ones which were £1.50 so guys that is the end of my Primark haul. I hope that you enjoyed it. I've picked up a really nice load of bits there. I'm super happy with everything that I picked up. That came to a total of £94 which I really didn't think was bad. I think they're killing it with summer dresses at the moment. They have some super nice ones and they're not that expensive so if you're after some summer wear I'd definitely go and check them out. I'm just gutted I couldn't get those few things that I originally went for. If you like the video, then please give it a big thumbs up. And if you're new around here, I would love, love, love you to subscribe. If you are new, I am Becky, obviously, and I am a mum to two girls and I make lifestyle videos, family vlogs, obviously shopping hauls and all that kind of thing. So yeah, I would love you to stick around and help my channel grow. So guys, I shall see you in my next one. Thanks a lot for watching. Bye.